So Learning Creative Learning has moved into a new studio here. Uh, actually, it's just my condo. We decided to meet here on the weekends and do the videos. Uh, but we'd like to welcome you to this week's Learning Creative Learning here at my condo. Um, and we've looked at uh, a lot of the posts from last week where peers were trying to uh, find time to talk about things they were interested in. And it was good to see some of the themes emerging that we hadn't really anticipated because also we've started thinking about uh, after the first six weeks, as you know, we want to move into projects. And so we're trying to get kind of the bigger themes and ideas that people are most interested in to, to help guide into the project work. Uh, and just one um, thing we want to mention specifically, there were lots of questions about ed camps based on Kristen's presentation from last week. Uh, and people were asking how to organize it, how do they get started. And so she's doing a virtual uh, event tomorrow, Wednesday, to help people think about maybe organizing an ad camp themselves or going to an ad camp. Uh, so the link is in the discussion forum, but if you're interested in ad camps, consider joining that. In addition to the discussions about the peers you know, from this past week, it was nice to see that there was also a continuing discussion from some of the previous weeks. And actually, I like that because in some mind, it, to me, it feels that's in the spirit of learning, creative learning. It's not that there's just an assignment each week that people get engaged with one of the topics or one of the activities. It's good to just keep on going with it. So I hope people will continue to just you know, dive in. And some of, the, some of those activities from the earlier weeks can also turn into projects you know, for the extension Absolutely. of the course. Yeah. So, so for this week, we're going to focus on the last of the four Ps, play. Mm -hmm. And we have several video segments. We'll start off with a video, video segment with the three of us talking about our views about play. And then we'll have two videos from two friends of ours, both named Eric. Uh, we'll have one from Eric Hansen, a longtime collaborator from the Lego company. We'll be talking about uh, the way that play gets integrated into the uh, you know, products developed at Lego that we've worked on together. And then we have Eric Rosenbaum from our group, who's one of the developers of Makey Makey, and we have him talking and showing a lot of examples of play and tinkering with Makey Makey. And after that, we'll go into breakouts, so we'll get a chance to break out, and you'll get a chance to have more discussions on some questions around play. And then we'll finish up with uh, uh, some, you know, looking ahead for the activity for this upcoming week uh, and setting the scene for the discussion about play for the upcoming week.